This is a quick video showing you some of the new AI tools that Canva now has built into its education suite, which you can get for free as a student and a teacher. And it'll let you collaborate on things that you're working on. So if you open up Canva, it'll look something like this. Yours might have a white background. I've got the dark background enabled. Uh, and ooh, that's a nice little fancy feature. Um, over here, if you click Magic Studio, where it says New, and it kind of gives you all these basic kind of overview things, but if you scroll down a bit, here's what we were looking for. There's Magic Write, and let's keep going. Uh, where's the magic? Here we go. Text to image. So there's actually text to video. I think I don't think that one's enabled yet. But text to image. Let's just check that Magic Write is working because it says Pro up there. Yep, seems to be working. That's pretty cool. So this works like similar to chat GPT, um, but you're allowed to use this one. It's baked into Canva. So I'm going to say, write me a short story about a monster who has lost his friends and how he finds them. All right, let's see if this works. Okay, so now it's made a story about Gronk. And I might even try and use some of this text to make a picture of Gronk. So it's a, a monster, let's uh, select this, a monster named Gronk. He was a big, strong, he was big, strong, had a heart of gold. Okay, and we might have to add some more descriptive words. So if I copy that, okay, and now go home. And we'll go back to Magic Studio and let's find the image one. Here we go. Text to image. Okay. Try it out. Okay. So over here is where you put in your prompt. It looks very similar to Night Cafe or Pick Finder or Starry AI or all those other ones that we've been playing around with. I'm going to paste that prompt in here. Monster named Gronk. He was big, strong, and had a heart of gold. Let's see what that comes up with. There's not much descriptive words, but I'm interested to see in what it does. It's um, rendering quite quickly, as you can see down here. Um, that's pretty good. Wow, it's coming up with some strange images of footballers. Okay, so that's kind of a bit useless. So I'm going to change my prompt. Um, uh, I'm going to put a green and red monster named Gronk. He was big, strong and had a heart of gold. He lived in a dark forest. Let's see what that comes up with. I could probably get rid of the Gronk because that makes no difference having a name. Oh, that's a bit better. Okay, so adding some descriptive words you've got a better chance of getting the image that you're after it's something good for the kids to learn so i might choose this one i think 
Cool. Um, and there it is. There is my image of Gronk that I could add to the story that AI just made. Um, so there's two easy ways to create text and images using AI in Canva. I'll make a few more um, higher level videos as we play a bit more around with it. All right, I hope this is useful.